Now, the trucks division profitability actually fell during the quarter. Shares are down, um, but you reported some strong numbers. How do you see profitability going on trucks, and what's the, the outlook for earnings in general? Generally speaking, I mean, I think we presented a solid quarter for, for the group as a whole, and, and when it came to the, uh, to the truck division, uh, the margin was down a little bit uh, from 10 to 9.6 percent on the back actually on uh, some supply restrictions during the end of the quarter. But the quality in the business is still solid and uh, uh, the general trend for the Volvo Group uh, is uh, continuing with uh, uh, underlying uh, profitability improvements. Um, sir, give me a sense of Trump's infrastructure plan. Are you starting to see the fruit of it? You raised your forecasts for North American market on the whole, but forecast is still below demand from last year. Yeah, it is. What, what we have seen when it comes to the truck side is actually that uh, our forecast now is that the, the market has bottomed out. We see the stock levels both for new trucks and used trucks are considerably better and uh, also uh, economic activities in in uh, in US generally strong so, so we are guiding up uh, from 215 mm -hmm. to 225000 units and and i think that is uh, a sign of recovery in our in our in our truck market and also on the construction side uh, it's a slight improvement as well uh, from from flat mm. to a small improvement so 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 that is the situation mr lundstad i'm absolutely <laughs> thrilled that the volvo vnl truck has 70 inches of headroom and a telescopic ladder i think you need a telescopic ladder to global gdp do you see global gdp getting better even while the developed companies lag behind uh, generally speaking, I mean, uh, we, we see a pretty solid uh, economic activity around the globe. So, so uh, I'm, I, our forecast is that GDP uh, will uh, be slightly better. I mean, we see it in, 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 in China, we see it in Europe uh, with the solid market uh, demand and also in, in U.S. as we, we were speaking about. So, so generally speaking, uh, uh, solid demand for our type of uh, products and services. What do you need for Mr. Draghi? <laughs> I, generally speaking, we, we don't talk about specific uh, needs from, from uh, either Mr. Draghi or someone else, but we are following that very closely, obviously, what they are doing. But uh, when it comes to Europe, I, I, I think we have a good uh, economic activity in general, and that is translated also into transport flows. And that is translated into infrastructural activities, and uh, that is coming into our businesses. So, so for the time being, I, I think Europe is an interesting place to, to operate within.